Hi guys and welcome! Today we are extremely proud to show to you the Yudu Web Control Panel. Here it is, but first things first, how do you assess it? Well, first you need to be connected to the very same network of your Yudu Neo, like I am now, and type yuduneo.local. This works on Mac OS X and Windows only if you have uh, some drivers installed, so refer to the documentation to see your requirements or a safe mode would be just inputting the IP address of your board. If instead you are connecting via USB, just type this IP address. You can find all of this information in the documentation. And what you get? Well, basically on the top side of the dashboard here, which will be the first thing you see, you have a connectivity overview, the IP address of the Ethernet port, the USB, and the wireless IP address along with the network name you are connected to. Then you have some information about your board, like the name, and this is important, we're gonna see later on why, then the very model that your board has, which is Udo Neo Full, and whether it is connected to the internet. And then here you can see real-time notifications of the motion sensors of your board, so move the board and you see them spinning. Then we placed some shortcuts to the most important part of documentation. The documentation also is present into the web control panel in an offline form, so it is quite useful because you will have the same information that you will retrieve online, but in an offline and handy format, for example when you are in hackathons or where you don't have internet connectivity but also you can configure your Udo Neo. By hitting Quick Configuration, you will have this. You can change the board name, so I can change it to My Neo. And if I hit Save, the board name will be now My Neo. So to assess it, instead of writing udoneo.local, I will write myneo.local. This will work just after a reboot. And this will be useful, for example, in the case you have multiple Udo Neos on a same network and you want to assess a particular one. Then you have the chance to connect to a wireless network, both protected and unprotected, by just clicking here and hitting save. Also, we placed a simple Arduino tutorial where you have two basic sketches, blink and fade. So by hitting run of one of them, you will see the notification LED, the status LID of your Udo Neo, blinking or fading. But there's more. In case you want to edit a Arduino sketch on the fly or write your own, you can find the Arduino editor. It is basically a very simple IED where you can place your sketch, for example, uh, editing, like I'm doing now, or writing uh, a new one from scratch. Please bear in mind that you cannot add libraries because this is very simple. For most advanced usage, we recommend you to use the Ubuntu Arduino IDE or use your external computer and then hit upload. The Arduino editor will now verify and upload the sketch for you and these operations will last approximately from 30 to 30 seconds. So. Please wait until you get the notification uh, that the sketch has been uploaded or that an error uh, has verified. So this is the first ve version, but we are really proud of it and we are looking forward not only to improve, but to receive uh, feedbacks and suggestions. And since it is open source, you can uh, actively contribute to it by sending pull requests or fixing bugs on our GitHub repository. So have fun and enjoy. 